Your spouse is not your enemy. Stop fighting the wrong battle. Don't fight yourself. Fight the real enemy because your spouse is not your real enemy. For the fact that there is misunderstanding between you and your spouse does not mean he or she hates you. It only means there is something you are yet to understand about each other. So stop fighting. Every couple has frictions here and there. But that shouldn't turn your spouse to your enemy. You are fighting the wrong enemy. The real enemy is the devil. When you fight against your spouse, you are fighting against your marriage. And that is what the devil wants. So stop doing God's job. It is not your job to feast your spouse. It is God's responsibility. Your job is to seek the face of God and allow God to change you. The change starts from you. Allow God to feast your spouse. Your job as a husband is to love and honor your wife. Protect her and pray for her. And as a wife, your job is to submit to him as your head. Respect him and pray for him. That is your job. So stop doing God's job. Stop standing on God's way. Stop fighting from the wrong side. Go on your knee. Fight on your knee. The right place to fight is on your knee. Stop fighting the right battle using the wrong tools. Insult, malice, beating, cursing, swearing, denial. Stop dragging the steering with your husband. Because two drivers cannot drive a car at the same time. There's only one steering. Allow the man to lead under God. And also wise men know when to hand, hand over the steering to their wives in specific situations. You know, men are built with plenty ego. So as a wife, don't contend with that ego. Don't go headlong with your husband. His strength is likely to be your weakness. And his weakness your strength. Know how to manage it. Feed your husband with respect. Husband too should feed their wives with love. Do not attempt to turn your wife to your slaves. Rather, lead and not your her with respect and love. She's not your slave. She's your helpmate. To everybody listening to me, stop the competition. Stop competing with yourself. The woman is a helpmate, not a roommate or a classmate. Never compete with against each other. Rather, work to complement each other. As it is recorded in the scripture, the man is a reflected glory of God, while the woman is an expression of man's glory. What this means to me is this. When my wife is shining, my life is glorious as the husband. If she's making it, if she's progressing, I should be happy because the root is in me. She was taken from me. Show me a woman that is not doing well. I will show you a man that has lost dream of his God's giving assignment. A wise woman knows how to hide under the glory of the man. How to hide under the glory of the man and return the glory to God. So, what I'm saying in essence is, we should stop fighting against each other. Let's come together. Go on our knees fight from our knee and fight the real enemy.